tutorial is designed to give you an overview of Google Slides. Google Slides is an online collaborative tool, much like PowerPoint would be in um, Office in Microsoft Office. Um, so, in order to access Google Slides, um, you are going to go to slides.google.com. You're going to want to log in with your WCPS. 5 and 3 email address and your password. Once you log into Google, Google Slides, you're going to come to a screen that shows all of the slides that you've created as well as the um, slideshows that have been shared with you. In order to add a new, um, to start a new presentation, there's a blank plus sign. If you just click plus, it's going to create your presentation. The first thing you're going to want to do is to name your presentation. You do that simply by clicking in the top left corner and I'm going to call this sample one. Now if for some reason I ever wanted to change the name of this Google Slides presentation I would simply click there again and make it um, make the changes and then click away and it saves automatically. To get us started I'm going to show you how to share a Google slide, how to change the theme and or the background of your Google slide presentation. So first thing, just like in any of your other Google uh, platforms, if you click on the share button in the top right hand corner, um, you are going to be able to invite collaborators to your presentation. Um, something important to note is that anytime you um, create a Google document, slide, whatever, under your WCPS login, it's automatically going to be set so that anyone with the a Washington County um, Public Schools account can view the link. Oftentimes you want to share these presentations with other people outside of Washington County, so to do that all you simply do is click on anyone with the link can access. If you wanted to allow anyone with the link to make changes, you would just click here to edit or comment. Once you've made the changes that you want to, ma want to make, just click Save. Um, again, you can email, you can invite people to your slide by entering their email address. Um, so you would simply just type in whatever their um, WCPS account is. Google Slides has several themes laid out for you. So if you click theme here, it's going to bring up this sidebar. If for some reason the sidebar is not there, click theme and it comes right back up. You can go through and choose any of the themes that are here for you. Um, and basically what a theme does is it kind of goes ahead and adds some formatting to your slideshow. If I were to insert a new slide, which I can go insert new slide, or I can do by going to slide, new slide. It's going to give me the, a new slide that is in that the format of the theme that I have chosen. Now, sometimes you may want to add an image to the background of your slide. In order to do that, you just click on background. You can, first of all, change the color of your background. So if I just click purple, it's going to make that one purple. Um, if I wanted to add an image, I can just click choose and this will allow me to go into my computer and find an image. So let's say I wanted to use this arts background. Um, simply open it and then click done and that's going to add this image to um, my slide. Now whenever I insert a new slide at this point, it's going to go back to the original theme that I had selected. If I wanted to have this image on all of my slides, whenever I go to background, I can click this button called Add to Theme. By doing that, it's going to make this background picture the background image of all of the slides in my presentation. Join me next for some more detailed information about editing um, your slideshow, adding shapes, pictures, and other um, fun features.